This is a public service announcement. Please share this information widely. The CDC has recently released information regarding the first severe case of H5N1 bird flu in the United States that occurred in Louisiana. They got the genetic makeup of the virus that infected that patient. And here's everything that you need to know about it. Today is Friday, December 27th, 2024. My name is Dr. Rubin. If you want to learn more about your health and stay informed about this virus, hit that follow button. This patient was recently infected with the D1.1 genotype of H5N1 bird flu. That's the genetic makeup of this virus. That is different than the B3.13 genotype that has been found in cows recently. This image behind me is from the CDC's report, and to summarize, they believe that most of the mutations likely occurred within the patient themselves as the virus was replicating, not likely from whatever bird infected this patient to begin with. Some of the mutations listed above may increase the ability for the virus to bind to cells in the upper respiratory tract of humans, but as of this time, there has not been any human-to-human -human transmission that has occurred. While genetic mutations have been noted in this particular patient, the CDC still considers the risk to the general public for an H5N1 outbreak to be low. However, as more and more people become infected from birds, there's more chances for mutations to happen that could end up leaking towards human-to-human -to -human transmission.